Hi guys, so in this video, we are going to see how to do digital circuit simulation with LT Spice. We are going to understand how we can simulate various digital circuits such as inverters, multiplexers in LT Spice. As an example, we'll try to simulate the 2 is to 1 multiplexer in LT Spice. To simulate any circuit in LT Spice, we are going to need certain components such as AND gates, NOR gates, which are not directly available in LT Spice. For that, we are going to have to download a library. So go to the link that is there on this slide uh, in blue, open a browser application and type this link. Once you go to that link, download the library onto your desktop. Now, once you've downloaded the library, you should have a zip file on your desktop. The library is called digital library 100.zip. That is the file name. Now right click and extract the contents of the zip file at the same location. You should see a folder called lib, lib lib created. Extracting this folder is not enough. We need to add this folder at the library location for LT Spice. So to find out what is the library location of LT Spice, open the LT Spice application. Click on the new schematic button to create a new schematic and then click on the component button. Look. Once click on the component button in the pop-up field, you can see in the top directory, the location, the library location where you have to add your libraries for LT Spice to recognize them. Now for most users who work on Windows, it should be C users documents. And so navigate to that location on your computing system, Windows, C, users, and so on. In this folder, LT Spice 17, you'll see a lib folder. Now you have to merge the contents of the lib folder that you downloaded with the contents of the lib folder already present in this LT Spice 17 folder. To do that, just copy the contents of the lib folder that you downloaded from the internet and paste them here. And when asked in the pop-up window whether you want to replace the files in the destination, click on that option. This will merge the contents of your lib folder with the ones already existing in the LT Spice 17 folder. This will successfully add all the digital components in the library into LT Spice 17 and now you can use them to simulate your own circuits. To see whether the library that we've added has been successfully added into LT Spice 17, Spice 17, you can click on the add component button again. And now in the pop-up window, you'll see a library digital logic now, if you double click on digital logic inside that you'll see all the components that the library has. For example, you'll see AND2, which is a two input AND gate. You will also see OR2, which is a two input OR gate. And you will also see AND3, which is an example of a three input AND gate. And these are just few of the many components you can find in the digital logic library.